So I'd like to show you guys the new career in Forza Motorsport 4. It's called the World Tour. This allows us to move people around the world and kind of bring them along through a career and play cool tracks all over the world. The career progresses through various seasons. There's a number of races in each season as you move through. Slick new user interface. We partnered with Bing Maps at Microsoft to get satellite imagery all over the world so that we could kind of zoom around the world and zoom in on all these tracks around the world. The first thing you'll notice here is that we now have a choice of events when we get to an event. And it has different rewards associated with each one. Just like with Forza 3, if you enter a race that your car isn't quite capable of, you can auto-upgrade it, you can switch out to different cars to make sure that you're competitive in that class. This is the first race of the career. We'll go through here, we'll do another race, and then see how some of it becomes kind of custom tailored as you play through. We've made huge investments in the graphics in Forza 4. I'll show another track later on, but this one even, this was a track that we shipped in Forza Motorsport 3 that has benefited from the complete rewriting of our rendering and lighting engine in the game. We're using a new technique now called high dynamic range image based lighting that takes high dynamic range images of the world and maps that back onto the car so the car inherits the lighting and reflections of the world around it. Not only does it look really dynamic, but it also makes the car look really seated in the environment. Here you can see some of the new visuals. We've also introduced 12 and 16 player races now as well. So in career you can race up to 12 people and then 16 player multiplayer makes deeper fields and depending on the mode we even have a passing mode now where you basically get unlimited cars on track as many as you can pass within the time so basically the number on number of cars on track doesn't really matter anymore we we map the right amount for the game mode that's most appropriate at the end of each season you'll have a championship race which are 12 car races but they're also a staggered race two times a day on each track. So you'll start the first race in the morning, the second race in the afternoon, and the lighting conditions are very different. It'll be kind of twilighty, sunset, and the track will look very different. Here you get a sense for some of the new cockpit lighting and rendering that we're doing here. In Forza 3, you would get a gift car for moving up a driver level. Well, in Forza 4, we're going to give you an option of cars to choose from. And depending on the choice you make, will influence and determine which events are available to you down later in the career. Basically what this means is no two careers are ever alike. So that's a quick look at Forza Motorsport 4. It's coming out starting October 11th.